वेलकम टू द डेली सिनॉप्सिस द रंगा रेड्डी कोर्ट एट कूकट पल्ली इन तेलंगाना हैज डिसमिस्ड अ पिटिशन फाइल बाय एन इंडिपेंडेंट फिल्म मेकर नंदी चिन्नी कुमार सीकिंग अ रिकॉल ऑन द जनवरी 2021 ट्वेंटी वन ऑर्डर विद द सूट फॉर डैमेज फाइल बाय हिम वॉज डिस्पोज ऑफ एज विदड्रॉन परस्यूएंट टू अ सेटलमेंट अग्रीमेंट The court also imposed a cost of 10 lakhs on Kumar which has to be deposited in the PM Cares fund. The litigation was initiated by an independent filmmaker who claimed that he had purchased the rights to make a film on the life of footballer Akhilesh Paul. Later a settlement agreement had been entered into between the parties after which Kumar had withdrawn the suit. However Kumar approached the court again with the present plea claiming that the agreement was based on fraud and misrepresentation he thus sought a stay on the release of the film this was dismissed by the court paving way for the release of the film Jhand starring Amitabh Bachchan Justice MM Srivastava will be taking over as the acting chief justice of the Rajasthan High Court from March 7th this year upon the retirement of the present chief justice of the high court akil qureshi the rajasthan high court has a sanction strength of 50 judges but it's currently functioning with a strength of 27 judges and a vacancy of 23 senior advocate aman lekhi has resigned from the post of additional solicitor general of india in a letter addressed to union law minister kiran rijeju lekhi said that he's tendering his resignation with immediate effect lekhi who was appointed to the post of asg in march 2018 has not given any reason for his resignation in the letter as a senior advocate lekhi had appeared in various high profile cases including the coal allocation scam case the commonwealth games scam case and the 2g spectrum scam case the supreme court today expressed shock at an order passed by the Punjab and Haryana High Court granting protection from arrest to former Punjab DGP Sumit Singh Saini in cases pending against him or likely to be registered against him in the future the top court expressed indignation on how the high court could have granted protection to Saini against cases which have not even been registered The court went so far as to say that it will request the chief justice of the high court to reassign the matter to another judge and not the one who passed the interim order. The Supreme Court on Friday said that it would hear on March 11th an appeal against the order of the Allahabad High Court granting bail to Ashish Mishra who is the prime accused in the lakhimpur kheri violence case in which eight people were killed the plea filed by the family members of the deceased farmers said that they have been forced to approach the top court since the state of uttar pradesh had failed to file an appeal against the high court order granting bail the appeal was mentioned by advocate prashant bhushan before a bench of the supreme court led by the chief justice of india nv ramana Subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the bell 